Hey everyone, happy Monday, November 2nd. Welcome to today's day trading update. Uh, plus $633.50 on the day. So you look at that at the end, you say, cool, nice green day, over 600 bucks in profit. But that doesn't tell the real story as uh, I was up over $1,500 at uh, around 9.15, about 45 minutes after the uh, market opened. Gave a bunch back, had to battle back. So very frustrating day uh, with some of the price action, but can't complain over $600, $633.50 is the ending P&L. So not too shabby. Uh, biggest winner, NASDAQ plus 434.50. Biggest loser was Amazon 420. Both of these were runners. In Apple, uh, had a, a mighty 90 that ended up going from a big winner to a loser. And then I made some of that up. Uh, in a runner, net net uh, minus 130 on the day. <clears throat> Facebook, a couple runners, net net 35 bucks. Microsoft runner 348, MU runner 152, Netflix runner 135, uh, Nikola runner minus 191, Tesla runner minus 114. Actually had a, a small mighty 90 win in there as well, net net minus 114. Uh, Twitter runner plus 122, Uber runner 282 uh, win. Uh, runner minus 240 and then zoom uh, that was a mighty 90 trade for 220 so let's check these out uh, starting with the nasdaq uh, so when the nasdaq uh, started out pretty strong but it was still the weakest of the bunch when it came down and broke below into negative territory tried to push it positive and then came back and consolidated that's where i got short right here and caught a nice little runner down uh, Apple. Okay. So Apple was the big frustrator of the day. So it had this initial push up. It pulled back. We got long right here as it broke through the lows, uh, on a mighty 90 signal, got long right here and rode that thing up. Those two big bars, uh, gave us a really nice profit. I got out of a decent amount, but I held on cause I was looking for, uh, to break the highs of the day and it never did that it rolled over i held on held on held on which if looking back at the the one mistake that i made is i held on to that law last piece uh just kind of in a hope mode thinking it would it would come back never did when it flushed down here this was actually a really good signal for a mighty 90 uh so i got long again uh, it started to bounce, but never, never did enough for me to get out of any and then just rolled over. So ended up turning what it was a fantastic winner into a net net loser on Apple for the day. Uh, Amazon, this one was a little frustrating because we had this little bounce here and I was trying to get short all day. I was, I, you know, just weak all day. Saw this little bounce. I was going to get short right here. Just use the, uh, the peak here as my exit point. It pushed up there. So I, I bailed, cut my losses quickly. Uh, unfortunately, it just, it, it bled down exactly what I wanted it to do. Unfortunately, got flushed out of that one. Uh, Facebook had this initial push. It was bouncing between these pivots. We got long for an upside runner, caught this nice piece here, uh, had a nice profit, came back down, we added, and then it just rolled over and ended up taking a uh, loss. I did get, once it, uh, once it broke down below this pivot and started consolidating, I did catch a little piece here for a winner, net net positive 35 bucks on the day in, uh, in Facebook. Microsoft caught a downside runner as well. Very similar, got into this one right at the same time as the NASDAQ, pushed into negative territory, was chopping around, and so we got short and caught a little runner here in Microsoft. Uh, MU caught a little downside runner as well. The other thing I don't, I didn't like how I was trading today was I did not let my runners run very well. I was, I was taking profits too quick after that disturbing Apple trade that got me all flustered this morning. Uh, but MU came down. I was, I was watching it was just kind of grinding lower all morning. Finally caught a, a downside runner right here. Cut this, cut this little piece. Uh, Netflix caught a little downside runner in Netflix. Oh, I'm sorry. No, Netflix was the, was an upside runner. It was strong and it was, it was kind of consolidating, bouncing around when it had that big push, broke through the highs. Um, came down, got long right here and just caught this little piece up right there. I was looking for more up to that pivot. Never did. So when it rolled over, I just cut out and, and took a little profit. Uh, Nicola. So Nicola had that big push up and then it was consolidating, consolidating. We got long, got right in here. 
Uh, I was looking for a bounce. Unfortunately, it flushed one more time, got us out before it did bounce. So it took a little loss in Nikola. Tesla. Uh, Tesla had this big, big bounce uh, initially. We actually got short right here and caught this little piece right here for a small winner in, a, in the Mighty 90 trade and then um, ended up trying to get long again right here and pushed up and then just rolled over. So net net in Tesla minus 114 on the day. Twitter. Twitter was weak all day. I was looking for a spot to get short here. It would just barely bounce and then roll over again. Finally, I got in on this little bounce here and caught a little piece of that. I was a super small, so $122 winner there. Uh, Uber. Uber. Uh, this was a early morning runner that we took. So we had this push and pushed up in between these pivots here, started consolidating, got long, caught this nice runner up here. Uh, we, we held on to a little bit, tried to, um, tried to look for another continuation up. It ended up rolling over, but still a nice winner, 282 bucks in Uba. And then, uh, when, so when we, we did catch a, a small, uh, we caught some puts right here and took a tiny profit out of win on a mighty 90 trade. Uh, I, with the, it was strong, one of the stronger stocks on the board. And it was just consolidating here. I was looking for another push up to the pivot, got long, got flushed out, and ended up taking a loss, a net of uh, 240 loss on win for the day. Zoom, big push up early in the morning, took a short here, rode that down for a little profit. Obviously, uh, left a lot on the table. Of course, you don't know that in, hind in hindsight. Can't trade that way, but uh, took a nice winner of 220 at a Zoom. So net netted on the day, plus $633.50. I'll take it because I don't feel like I traded very well today. So hope that was helpful. Uh, let me know if you guys have any questions. We will talk to you tomorrow, Election Day. See ya.